this video I want to take a look at a really cool item which was actually a gift to me from my friend Yanni in Finland but um I, I like it so much I've been using this thing every single day since I got it it's a really cool little reasonably priced deal and I'm talking about the uh Sunto Clipper watch band compass that's what's coming up next here on survival on purpose Welcome back to Survival on Purpose, your home for information and gear reviews related to camping, survival, and general preparedness for regular folks. My name is Brian. Thanks for joining me. So, got the sun in my face, so it won't be glaring on the camera, but uh, I'm kind of out here in the middle of the woods, trying to do something a little different instead of uh, staying in the backyard today. And I want to show you something that my, um, my, my friend and subscriber, Yanni from Finland, was kind enough to send me a, a, a few things and one of the things he sent me was this Sunto Clipper watch band compass. Uh, this thing is like under 17 bucks on Amazon. It's, it's a liquid filled jewel um, pivot compass uh, from the folks at Sunto which um, they are in a, in a very excellent compass brand. I think they're from Finland so um, that's probably why Yanni included this but uh, my actual main compass is a Sunto MC2. I have a lot of confidence in them. Uh, this one is it's got a couple of features that I've not seen on other watch band compasses. There may be some that would have it, but um, I've not seen them. But this one's really cool. I've checked this thing out um, many, many times. Let me just show you um, again. Uh, again, several other compasses, and it is absolutely true and accurate. So what's cool about it is, first of all, the cardinal directions of north, south, east, and west are luminous. So um, they will glow after being exposed to light. And then, I don't know if you can see this, but it's got a little directional arrow here. And the bezel rotates on this just like a big compass, right? Let me show you. So, so you can, I can't even tell if, I, if you can see. Okay, so, yeah, so it rotates just like a big compass, which is very, very handy. So this, this makes this actually a lot more usable for, like, navigation. Um, it's not going to be as precise as a, as a larger compass, but um, it can get you a lot closer than, than, than a lot of other compasses. So I am happen to be stuck out here. Um, I'm kind of, my truck is... I am, I got to go southeast that direction behind me for about 100 yards, and then I got to turn um, south. So, I mean, it's, it's, it's just a small compass. Hopefully, this will be a small video. But let me just show you how you would use this compass to do that and why I think this is such a cool thing to have. Okay, so apparently I forgot to hit the record button. So I'm going to piece in a little bit of footage I'd shot earlier that had bad audio just to kind of explain how to use this little compass. Especially, you can just turn the bezel so that your desired bearing lines up with the direction of travel arrow on the housing. Then line up the north marking on the internal compass disc with the north marking on the bezel. And the direction of travel arrow will point you in the direction you need to go. Um, you can see, if I'm standing here like this, I just got my arm out in front of me just, just normally like this at about this angle. That puts the arrow pointing straight. Like right now, it's pointing straight at the camera. So that's a very natural position to put your arm in. You don't have to do anything, anything weird. Just kind of like where it needs to be for you to look at it. And it actually is a really good position for you to look at the compass too. And so you can make sure the, the, the north indicator here, right, is pointing towards, let me get around here where you can see it. So you get to where your north indicator is pointing towards north, and then you're going to walk straight towards that little direction of air travel arrow. That's going to take you... You'll be going to about 135 degrees, 100 something like that, 150 degrees, whatever that, whatever the uh, kind of halfway between east and south is, which would be southeast. And that's really all there is to it. If you want to change directions, when I get to about 100 yards, I'm going to put it to south, which means I'm going to turn this back here to S to the arrow direction of traffic, and I'm going to orient myself a little bit more, and I'm going to turn that way. And there you go. So that's really all there is to it. I think it's just a really handy little thing. Let me throw my uh, Hidden Woodsman haversack on and we'll uh, well, turn around and we'll uh, head back to the truck. Well, turn it down to southeast. Put the, the end on north and head away. Man, Survivor Man goes back a whole lot to get his camera, doesn't he? Okay, well, hopefully the fact that I'm back at the truck is a good indication that the compass actually works. So, um, again, I think this is just a really cool little deal. Under 20 bucks, uh, and they actually have these both for the Northern Hemisphere and the Southern Hemisphere. This one is for the Northern Hemisphere because that's where I am. And so if you're looking for, actually, I didn't think about this till just now, but if you're looking for a great Father's Day gift, this could be it because it just it just and by the way just I didn't even show you that I should have shame on me it just uh 
it just clips off and clips back on. Um, I like it so much, I even slightly modified my watch band so it would fit better. But uh, it fit okay without it, but it just snaps on, and there you go. So, really cool little deal, the uh, Suunto Clipper. I will put an a Amazon link in the description below if you want to purchase it through that link. It'll help benefit the channel, and you'll get a pretty cool little, little, little compass too. So, Yanni, thank you, thank you, thank you for uh, the really cool gifts. Um, especially the, the, the compass. I, I, everything was cool, but this is, I just wanted to see, see, I'm actually wearing this every single day. I like it a lot. So, um, and as always, thank you for watching Survival on Purpose. I put out a brand new video every Friday and every Saturday and very often random videos throughout the week. You can check out another one right there behind the truck. If you're not subscribed, you can click right down there behind the truck wheel and take care of that. Click that little bell on whatever screen YouTube takes you to. You can get notified whenever I put out new videos. I really appreciate your support. Once again, my name's Brian. You're watching Survival on Purpose. Remember, survival's not an accident. So be prepared. I'll see you next time.